Hey guys, what's going on? So here's a few updates for you. In the house, the roof is done. They put up the insulation, put up this bag. We purchased the tongue and groove ceiling. The skylights are in, but the beams still have to be cut and it has to be boxed in. But last night, we had a huge leak coming in through, so that's why I ripped the bags. I went to the office, so you'll see that update in this video. But for now, what I have to do is drink some cheap red wine. March 25th, look at this. Uh, apparently they still have to uh, patch up some stuff here. I guess that's the caulk that's got to be painted there. Uh, the wall, they fixed the wall, but uh, that's where there used to be a window. The outline of the window is still there. But look at this, this is the first time that I actually see that there's like progress in this office. They didn't put these uh, walls together because apparently there's some electrical stuff and inspections going on, but uh, check out the video on March 21st that I'm gonna put after this. This was the meeting that I had with him a few days ago and uh, some disagreements that we had again. Yeah, I think we're doing good, man. Don't let it stress you out. How are you doing, sir? Hello, how are you? Good, good. What's going on? What's that? You going to bed? No. Oh, okay. All right, Paul, this is the one you said. I sent you a text breaking down everything. Okay. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. The problem, if we take this door and leave it like this, this, this is not how you wanted it, right? Yeah, you have the plans, right? I mean, look at it. Watch. <laughs> you mentioned that it's not swimming the right way, so I assume it No, no, not this one. It was those two over there. Right, because we, we, I mean, how's the wheelchair going to get in here? Yeah. The plans, it's going this way. Beautiful. So I was just telling them we have to change that. Right. Okay. Be clear on that. Um, Did you get the plans or no? No, no. because as we'll talk about it, he wasn't clear. Yes, we are going to paint those rails. Uh -huh. Good morning. Hey, how's it going? Hello. Yeah. Yeah. We were experimenting with the stains last night, and um, this is what we came up with. So Mila's been experimenting with all these stains and uh, what we decided is we want that darker one for the office and this one, which I'm not crazy about, she wants it for the house, so. So, I mean, obviously it's, you know how to stain as opposed to paint, right? Because <laughs> when it's painted, it's different. When it's stained, it's different. Paul, did you understand what's going on with the plans that I sent you? I have no clue. Okay. Because of where we are now, it triggered a plumbing inspection and a life plan inspection. Life plan is for the fire department. Right. But the architect, you have to, at this point where we are right now, unless you could put this together, I rely on an architect to take care of all these things for me. I don't get involved with that aspect. Oh, I'm going to tear it down and I'm going to start framing. I, so when my architect comes, your frames are up. Oh, okay. So you are going to slowly work during this whole time. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, so what? We're looking at two months, right? Less than that. So, I don't know if you want to go do your research and figure, you can figure out what you need to do. Um, we're also now going to have to bring in a plumber. And you're going to have to tell where all the equipment is going because the plumber has to put that on his drawings. I mean, I told you where everything is going. Okay, but did you put that on your plan? It's all there. Everything that we talked about is there. All the equipment is We've on talked about it. Could I get another copy of it, please? If you have another copy of it, email it to me. Alright, so short of that, anything else dealing with those plans, I gotta rely on you to take care of it because I don't get that involved. So what did I hire you for? You hired me as a contractor to do the work. The architect does the plans. You didn't want to hire the architect that I referred yeah, to. Yeah. Okay, let me let me back up by saying again, your architect, you will bring the architect. We all have it on record, okay? And that you will supply the plans and you will everything. And then you gave me a line of BS that 
the plans are residential or the, the contract is residential and not commercial. Just like I told you in the beginning, I hired you because I rely on you. Just like I told you in the beginning, I need your help. I want everything according to code. We walked around. I showed you the electrical stuff. I showed you everything. I said, every, we even talked about how many feet from each wall, each whatever it is, how many feet apart uh, um, electrical is supposed to be. You gave you me a ignoring, price. Are you ignoring what I just said? Are you ignoring what I said? No, I didn't, and I'm okay. going to explain again to you. Do what you I have do, to do. Do, I, do. do what you have to do. Do what you have to do. Uh, okay. right, I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. Get your architect. I'm waiting on have you. me use my architect to do what we need to do. But I'm not going to move forward until you give me the okay in writing to move forward with my architect. I, I gave you the okay in writing four months ago. I gave you the, in, the okay four months ago in writing. Matter of fact, I signed it. We both signed it. Yes, I did tell you I'll go with it after you told me, blah, 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 you couldn't find it. I said, okay, we'll try this. This isn't working out. So I mean, you have to do what you guys do because remember what we talked about in the beginning? Uh -huh. Remember when I used to walk around with the camera? Or I still walk around with the camera? Uh -huh. Remember you told me? You said, you, and we were right here. You said, you supply the door and put the board and molding and we will match the baseboards. But, but you're going to take when off. When you bring your door, your door is going to have the molding. So what oh, is that how it works? Out? I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Whatever door you bring, we'll okay. match okay. the molding on the ground to meet. Yeah, like all these baseboards we talked about. Like yeah. this so looks like garbage here. That's that's, okay. Yeah. All right. Like new. <laughs> okay, so that's this. And that's on record, we will too. We match so. the baseboard based on what you have. You want to use this? It's not gonna look good. I'll okay. put it on. It's not gonna look good. I, I'm okay if it looks. I'm okay. I like that. I like that like baseboard. Yeah, that's it baseboard. Too. And yeah. it'll be short because I use a bunch of. Well, what are you? What are you short? Sure no, I'm because he told me to get certain amount of. He told me to get certain amount because he measured it out. And well, then I got an extra hundred feet for well, the doors. Well, well. Just like what you told me. Well, so I got what you told me for the doors, and well, I got what you told me. Well, and as a matter of fact, I was being nice by buying it because according to everything, I wasn't supposed to buy it. Okay, Paul. So. Even if I tell you I need 10 feet and I need 11, you gotta get me the 11 feet. This is not an exact sign. Well, according, to, the, according to what we talked about, right. according to uh, what we signed and what's... That's it. That's it. Put down whatever you need to, whatever you can, you just stop. Just work with what you have. Mm -hmm. When you run out, let me know at what point you run out. I'm All right. All right. I just don't know how to fix my board as well as I know how to fix it that way. Yes. Do the best you can with it. Put it. Let's go now. And uh, oh, hey, what about what about like this right here? Does it still? Yeah, he's still, he's still working on that. Yeah, okay. You're still working on this wall, right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. All right, that's it. Call me. 